name is Nathan Hall. I'm a services application manager out of uh, our Johnson office for Devon Pioneer. Uh, talking a little bit about, about our Field 360 Select program. Our Field 360 Select program is our subscription-based service that we just kind of started with here recently. Uh, what it allows us to do is to place our uh, all the information that our growers are sharing with us, all the information that our sales reps have been working with our growers to share over the past few years. We able to incorporate that into a system that's web-based, tablet-friendly, laptop-friendly. It's really being able to incorporate all the information, give it back to the grower without having to report directly to the sales rep to see the information they've been sharing with us. So it kind of gives us a full farm and field structure based on the grower's information. You can go back and access any of the uh, historical information that they've got in the system. Uh, so I can go back as far as 15 years for yield mapping, some guys 10, some guys just two years of yield mapping. What they can do is pour down from an operation level. You can see their entire operation on a map screen. You can see all the field boundaries that kind of shared with us and information. They can pour down into just individual fields as well. So I'm using my uh, dad's home operation in southwest Iowa. This is our home farm. Uh, he shared his uh, past planted and then uh, yield mapping cards with us. So that information gets automatically right into the system, shows up. And it gives us the ability to go through. We can either view that information or we can also go through and track our crop progress, our growth staging models. So when I click on our crop progress tab um, for this particular product, a P1498 HR, it was planted on May 15th. It shows our estimated precipitation and GDO accumulation. Uh, it gives us an estimated black layer date based on the, the crop model that we've got, as well as an estimated growth stage. Uh, growers can kind of come through here, they can track their GDU accumulation on a daily basis. They get uh, the accumulated GDUs of how many uh, heat units they've received versus last year, which is a purple bar where we're way above average. We've got a 10 year average bar, and then you can see a little bit below this year. The same process with the precipitation on a field by field boundary basis, you're able to go through and track and see how much rainfall you've received per field boundary, as well as the overall drought stages or potential wet stages of the year from your planting data on. So with that information, besides on a field-by-field -field basis, you do have the ability to go through and you can turn on your information and you see it on the map level. So when I turn on my weather information, it tells me that I've had 24 inches of rain since January 1st for this field boundary. I come back on the entire operation level. It's going to zoom back out and it's going to color coordinate all of my field boundaries based on what the information is being brought into the system. So this Field 360 Select is kind of completes the 360 degree with all of our other services. Everything really synchronizes together nicely with our Field 360 Studio, which is our uh, Precision Ag desktop software program, as well as our Field 360 Notes scouting app. So if a grower goes out and takes individual scouting notes, if uh, the sales rep or agronomist takes notes and they want to share that with the grower, that comes back into this system and they can simply turn on their Field Notes layer. Push pins are going to appear here on the screen based on all the notes that have been taken. So a grower that can then go back into an individual field. You're going to see a large push pin there in the corner. They can simply click on that push pin. And it's going to pull up all the information, pictures, scouting information that's been taken for that particular operation. So a real-time communication, more grower facing, be able to really get the data back in front of the grower since they've been so willing to share it. So we've also got a feature here called Current Location. We use the service with a uh, GPS capable iPad or a smartphone or other um, Android device. You can go out, turn on your current location, go out and scout your fields based on your variable seeding prescriptions, your as planted mapping, uh, satellite imagery, or any other layers of information that they've chosen to put into the system for us. As we continue to build this out, we'll be adding additional functionality. Um, the subscriptions are $499.95. That can be uh, invoiced through their sales rep. And that subscription is good through March of 2015. So it's a nice year and a half. It's almost two years worth of growing seasons for one subscription. And there's no additional charges anywhere in between there.